Oh yeah. I just got my first big one of the day. Oh my lord. Yes sir. Well, good morning y'all. We are back out here in the test waters and I'm excited because today I have a brand new bait to show you that just got released. And no, this isn't clickbait. This is a real brand new bait that just got released by Rock Creek Bait Company. Let's take a look at that bait right now. That is a Rock Creek Bream Bomb. That is a 1 32nd ounce jig with a size 8 sickle hook, which is perfect for the mouth of bream. So for panfish, whether you're looking at bluegill, shellcracker, crappie, and what I'm going to do today is I got that rigged up on four pound test line, and there's the other one. I will have a link below. Let's put this bad boy to work and see what we got right off the bat. Oh yeah, there we go. Beautiful, y'all. Look at that. Beautiful bass. That one was on the Verde Brain Bomb. There we go. Very nice. Look at that. Beautiful. Beautiful bass on the Brain Bomb. All right, y'all. Let's catch another one, shall we? Just slowly letting the pendulum look back to me. Pop it. Waiting for the bite on the fall. There we go. There's a nice one. All right, y'all. There's our next fish. Beautiful. Take a look at that. They are liking the bottom hair jig on the that is the verde bream bomb. All right. Absolutely beautiful. Look at those colors. Very nice. Let's catch another one. Now you 100% could probably fish this under a bobber if you wanted to. Kind of hold it in the water column if you know exactly where they're hitting you at. There we go. There's another one. That was a little one, y'all, which shows you that hook is small enough to get into their mouths. I'm going to throw that one back. So, guys, what I do is I reel up here, and then I let that, look at that, right off the bat, Mike got one. And see the big bass that came up behind it? Oh, that's a nice one, Mike. That's a decent one. There we go. Finally, a little bit of size to it. Nice. Good job. There you go. Nice. That's a nice one, Mike. Beautiful. Look at that. Good job. There you go. Nice. That's a decent one. Oh, beautiful. Good job, Mike. That's a beautiful one. Right there. Right at the bank. Yeah. Look at that. <laughs> right at the bank, y'all. Another beautiful one. Let's add that to the bounty. So far, they have all preferred the verde color. Beautiful. Sometimes you can. There we go. Nice. Right off the bank. Right. Nope, he's not very big. Guys, when you're using this ultralight gear, especially when you're throwing these smaller bream bombs like this, they are so much fun because these fish feel massive. Beautiful. We're going to let that one go. Go get bigger, buddy. Pond fishing tip number one. Guys, if you're dealing with a lot of brush like this and you don't want to use lose a lot of your tackle around the edges, sometimes it's better to use a bobber. Mike is using a bobber. Has not had to retie once. I am not using a bobber and I'm about to retie for a third time and I can't get that tackle back that I've lost. Here we go. Oh yeah. I just got my first big one of the day. Oh my lord. Yes sir. Look at that y'all. Absolutely beautiful. Absolutely inhaled that Rock Creek Green Bomb. Step up here so we don't lose it. Oh yeah. Look at that. Beautiful. That's what I'm talking about. Beautiful. Oh, did you see all the swirls behind it? Yeah. There's all kinds of fish in there. Oh, Look at the size of these bluegills, y'all. Guys, this is what you're calling a pond fish smackdown. There we go. There's another one. Oh, nice. All right, y'all. That's another one. Beautiful. Look at that. Yes, sir. All right, y'all. Check that one out. Absolutely beautiful. Guys, the best way to beat the heat, get up early, have a good spot that has some shade and stuff in it, and know how you're going to fish for the fish that, you, that you're that you targeting. 
getting up early makes all the difference in my opinion panfish hit hard first thing in the morning and last hour before uh, dark and they actually hit pretty well at nighttime too guys the reason i switched to bobbers with all this debris and brush here i've lost five of these bream bombs and they are just so the quality that goes behind them it makes you frustrated because these are really nice baits so to lose them you know yeah. no one ever wants to lose tackle much less tackle that really works so i i am not too big of a man to put a bobber on and hold my bait where i need it at and to make them come out of the brush to get it y'all we're filling up the cooler the bluegill for the way that you could catch them and the numbers you could catch them and the way they taste oh yeah oh Nice one. Oh my goodness. Please don't get wrapped around anything. Come here. Oh my goodness. Y'all, is that a bass? Is that a bluegill? That's a bass. Okay. Yes. All right, y'all. Look at that. That's the second bass on this Rock Creek bream bomb. Doesn't just catch bream. All right. Beautiful. Look at that. Very nice. Yes, sir. Oh yeah. That's a nice gill. Oh yeah, come here, baby. Oh my goodness. Do not come off, do not come off. Look at that. That's, your hog. That's why we're not leaving, y'all. That's the big one of the day, brother. Absolutely beautiful. That is a monstrosity of a fish. All right, y'all. Let me get a good grip on this thing first. It's wanting to poke me. Look at this fish. I mean, y'all, that is big. That's a big for a bluegill. It absolutely inhaled that Rock Creek Verde Bream Bomb. Yes, sir. That's what I'm talking about. Got him. Oh, yeah. That's a nice one. Oh, yeah. Come here, baby. Yes, sir. Look at that, y'all. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Very nice. I'm going to add that one to the bounty. Oh, nice one. Big old bluegill. I mean, and it did not hesitate, guys. It slammed that thing. They are inhaling these Rock Creek Bream Bombs without hesitation, y'all. Look at that. Absolutely beautiful. The fish is nice, too. <laughs> That bait is just, I'm, I mean, and I'm not saying it just because of it's a new bait, but just the effort. You know, he's got multiple different materials on that thing. And you almost don't want to fish it because it looks so nice. There we go. A little bluegill. Nice. Man. Oh, missed him. <laughs> you know, if I would have landed that, uh, that crappie... That would have been a good way to end it, you know? Yeah. There we go. Look at the size of that gill. Oh, look at that, Mikey. Beautiful. Yep. Hard. Check that out, y'all. Another beautiful one. Got him. Yes. And y'all, with that, we're going to end our video with this spring bomb. Wow, oh, beautiful. Look at that. Beautiful black crappie. Yes, sir. Beautiful. All right. Let that one go. All right, y'all. I'm going to put a quick shot of the fish we caught today. These are the ones that we pulled out of the cooler. That massive cooler full of fish right there. These ones are all nine inches or bigger. Some of them are pushing 10 inches, but absolutely laid the hammer to them. The Rock Creek Brain Bombs, they are brand new. Once again, Rock Creek Bait Company. There's a link in the description below and exclusive to the next cast viewers, there's a discount code. Click on the link below, use the code. I'm telling you guys, you're gonna wanna get these. This bait will change the way you fish. As always, get outside, go fish and have fun, and we'll see you 
on the next cast.